President Biden is describing the supplemental funding that we're providing to Ukraine, he says, quote, it's also going to help schools and hospitals open. It's going to allow pensions and social support to be paid to the Ukrainian people so they have something, something in their pocket. It's, help me understand how U.S. taxpayers paying for pensions in Ukraine is, is a good idea for our country. Uh, I would defer you to other parts of our government. The Department of Defense doesn't have a role in, in uh, pensions in Ukraine. You're a senior Biden administration official. The president said that it's really important that we keep funding the pensions in Ukraine. I would observe that the U.S. Census Bureau says that in 2022, the U.S. pension shortfall is $1.4 trillion. So while we have a corrupt Ukrainian government, while we have our watchdog here who can't say that we followed the law on in use monitoring, we have the President of the United States saying we need to fund pensions in Ukraine. Meanwhile, the pensions of our fellow Americans are in greater jeopardy.